Hello everyone, we will continue the topic smart forms and in the previous video, we displayed the graphics or logo in the smart forms. Firstly, we uploaded the graphics or logo in the SAP system through SC78 transaction code. Then we created a window in the smart form and we created a graphic inside the window and we gave the name of the graphics. We passed the object ID. We choose the color bitmap image. We provided the resolution. And yes, after that, yes, our logo or graphics is displaying in the smart form. Now we will extend this particular topic. Now what is our topic? How to display a logo or graphics dynamically, dynamically. Now, what is the meaning of this particular topic? Suppose customer is saying, if this is the condition, I want logo one to be displayed. If this is the condition, I want logo to be displayed. If this is the condition, I want logo three to be displayed. So it means we are displaying the graphics or logo dynamically based upon a condition. As of now, in the output of the smart form, we gave the, we gave the name of the graphic. It means we are displaying one logo or graphic in the smart form. If I will go for running of this smart form through the trans through the driver program, if I will run, if I will give the order number, if I will pass the output device. So always, always this smart form will display this logo. Now this is not the scenario based upon a condition we need to display the graphic and this is real project. Yes, many time customer based upon a condition ask different, different logo or graphics to be displayed. So how, how we will go for this particular scenario. So firstly, we will take a requirement. Suppose what customer is saying, if the currency, if in the output currency is INR, if the currency is INR, I want this Tata underscore logo to be displayed. If the currency is INR, you can display Tata underscore logo. If the currency is other than INR, if the currency is other than INR, I want a different logo to be displayed. So it means based upon the value of the currency, we will display different, different image or logo in the smart form. So how we will go for that particular thing. So firstly, what I will do, we already have one graphic in, in our SAP system that is Tata underscore logo. I will upload one more graphic in the SAP system through SC78 transaction code. So I will go to SC78 transaction code and I will upload one more graphics in the SAP system. I will expand this. I will click on to bitmap. Suppose I will upload Capgemini logo. Yes. I will upload this logo. So I will simply click on to import button. Now I will choose another graphics or image. I will give some name. Suppose I am saying Capgemini underscore logo. I will give the short description. Suppose I will choose color bitmap image. 
I will go for OK. Now graphic is imported. I can check the print preview also. This is the print preview. If currency is INR, if I will go for another logo, what was our previous logo? Tata underscore logo. If currency is INR, I will display Tata underscore logo. If currency is other than INR for a particular order number, I will display cap Gemini underscore logo. So based upon a condition, we will display different, different graphics. So what I will do, I will go to the smartphone. In the smartphone, I will go to global definitions. You all know you can declare the variable in the global data. Suppose I will declare a variable. Suppose I will say LV underscore logo suppose or I will write LV underscore graphics. Suppose I will give the type. Suppose the type is character 20. If I will double click on character 20, character 20 has is a data element which has a domain of character 20. So LV underscore graphics is of character type and length of 20. I will go to initialization and I will write the logic for the same. Now your header data, your header data, your header data is coming into which internal table? LT underscore data. Your header data is coming into which internal table? LT data. From LT data, you are passing to which work area? LS data. It means LS data, which particular column you have the value of the currency? C-U-R-R. So how I will write the logic for the same. If LS underscore data hyphen. What is the name of the column? C-U-R-R is equal to INR. If it is Indian rupees, we need to go for which particular logo? What is the variable name? LB underscore image. I will assign the first, first image name. What is the first image name? Tata underscore logo. Else part, LV underscore image is equal to cap Gemini underscore logo. For every if there is a and if. Now, but a logic I have written. If the currency is INR, what is the value of the variable? Tata underscore logo. Else the value of the variable will be cap Gemini underscore logo. I will take this as a output variable. Output parameters. LV underscore image. I will check the syntax and I will activate Okay, I gave LV underscore graphics. Sorry. Here also, I will write LV underscore graphics. I will check the syntax and I will activate up to this level. Now you assign the image name or graphics name to this particular variable. Now it means this variable needs to be used. So I will go for the graphics which you are displaying. 
Now, what is the rather than Tata underscore logo? Previously, you hard coded the image. Now, you cannot go for Tata underscore logo. You need to use this particular variable. Variable and what is the name of the variable? LV underscore graphics. So, in the next video, we will see how to use in the graphics. So, what is the summary of this particular video? In this video, we are covering how to display a logo or graphics dynamically. What do you mean by dynamically? Dynamically means the logo will change depends upon the condition. And what the requirement we took? If the value of the currency is INR, we will display one logo that is Tata logo. If the value of the currency is other than INR, we will display Cap Gemini logo. So as a part of that, Tata logo was already in the system. So up, I uploaded another logo that is Cap Gemini logo. I took a variable in the global data. I gave the variable name of type character 20 and the initialization. I have written the logic. If the currency value is INR, we will go for Tata underscore logo. If the currency value is other than INR, we will go for cat Gemini underscore logo. In the next video, we will do the changes in the graphics. Then we will go for the testing in the debugging. So that's it in this video. Thank you.